How's it going movie fans? The 22nd of October 2022 is the 70th birthday of actor Jeff Goldblum. One of the most eccentric and charismatic actors working today, who has amassed an audience who adores him in and out of character. In 1974, Goldblum made his on-screen acting debut in Death Wish, and in 1996 he was nominated for an Academy Award for short film Little Surprises, which he directed. Goldblum currently has five projects either announced or in production, including Asteroid City, which is due for release later in 2022. Here are the Firewall's top 10 Jeff Goldblum movies. At number 10 is Silverado. In this western, Emmett is a cowboy who while on the road to the frontier town of Silverado, assembles a group of misfit cowboys happening upon them in different circumstances, but many of them have unfinished business with the corrupt sheriff of the town. Goldblum plays Calvin Stanhope, aka Slick, a notorious gambler. The running time is 133 minutes, and Silverado has the final rating of 7 out of 10. At number 9 is The Life Aquatic with Steve Sisu. Steve Sisu is an oceanographer whose best friend is eaten by a creature he calls a jaguar shark while working on a documentary. This inspires Sisu to form his next project around the destruction of the jaguar shark. Goldblum plays Alistair Hennessy, a fellow oceanographer and Sisu's nemesis. The run time's on 19 minutes, and The Life Aquatic with Steve Sisu has the final rating of 7.2. At number 8 is Deep Cover. After witnessing the worst side of drug addiction, Russell Stevens Jr. becomes a police officer who is then recruited by a DEA agent to go undercover as a drug dealer and infiltrate a drug smuggling operation. Goldblum plays Stevens attorney David Jason. The run time's 107 minutes, and Deep Cover has the final rating of 7.2. At number 7 is Independence Day. Following the arrival of an alien mothership on Earth, which strategically positions smaller ships across the globe, followed by a show of force, satellite engineer and technological expert David Levinson, played by Goldblum, gets involved in the plan to defend Earth from further attacks. The run time is 145 minutes, and Independence Day has the final rating of 7.2. At number 6 is Invasion of the Body Snatchers. A remake of the 1956 film of the same name, in this sci-fi horror, Goldblum plays Jack Belichick, an aspiring writer and a friend of Matthew Bennell, who is among the first to realise that something strange is going on in San Francisco, California, where the population are being turned into emotionless shells. The run time's on 15 minutes, and Invasion of the Body Snatchers has the final rating of 7.9. At number 5, is The Fly. Seth Brundle, played by Goldblum, is a brilliant scientist who has been experimenting with instantaneous teleportation, but runs into issues with teleporting live tissue. In a drunken state, Brundle decides to use himself as a test subject, but when a fly gets into the machine, it leads to the experiment going horribly wrong. The run time's 96 minutes, and The Fly has the final rating of 8.2. At number 4, is Thor Ragnarok. In the 17th installment of the Marvel Cinematic Universe, Goldblum plays the Grand Master, the ruler of the planet of Sakaar, where the contest of champions is held which pits great warriors against each other. Thor finds himself on Sakaar after being captured and sold as a gladiator. The run time is under 30 minutes, and Thor Ragnarok has the final rating of 8.5. At number 3, is Isle of Dogs. In this animated comedy, Goldblum voices Duke, a member of a pack of dogs who are living on Trash Island after being banished from the city of Megasaki following an outbreak of dog flu. But a young boy travels to the island to rescue his dog, but faces government resistance. The run time is 101 minutes, and Isle of Dogs has the final rating of 8.5. At number 2, is the Grand Budapest Hotel. Set in the early 1930s, when Zero Mustafa becomes the new lobby boy for the esteemed Grand Budapest Hotel, where he gets caught up in the drama surrounding the death of Madame D, a wealthy client of the hotel. Goldblum plays Deputy Vilmos Kovacs, Madame D's attorney who reads her will. The run time is 99 minutes, and the Grand Budapest Hotel has the final rating of 8.8. .8. At number 1 is Jurassic Park. Dr. Ian Malcolm, played by Goldblum, is a mathematician who is among a group of experts who are brought in to preview a new theme park where dinosaurs have been bioengineered back into existence. But when the security systems are deactivated, the dinosaurs get loose. The run time is 127 minutes, and Jurassic Park has the firewall rating of 9. Thanks for watching. Next week, I'll be hunting down the firewall's top 10 Ben Foster movies. And if you enjoyed this list, please don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe.